Roads in Brighton are sinking. In fact, had to uh, force the city to close down a four block area. And neighbors are understandably upset, especially since the city just finished work in that area. Here is Denver 7's Patrick Perez. It was a perfect storm of events. The city says there was a water main break here in this area last week. It kind of caused it to remain in a frozen state, if you will. Then the sun came out and thawed that water, but that's what created a gap between the soil and the asphalt, which then caused some of these sinkholes to form. 7th Avenue at Longs Peak Street in Brighton is looking like a cube of Swiss cheese. It's driving me crazy. The city says sinkholes formed Monday afternoon, forcing closures along this four block area. For Judy V. Hill, it's deja vu as crews are back in front of her home once again. They spent all summer here, right in front of my house, up the way, and now they're back at doing the same thing. That summer project was to make storm drain improvements, but old infrastructure sometimes fails as it did in this case. This really is an unforeseen event. Linda Ong with the city of Brighton says a water main break last week flooded the street in freezing temperatures, causing a ripple effect of problems. The freezing temperatures basically froze the water in the impacted area and basically stabilized all the impacted area in that frozen state. Now thawed, the soil compacted and created a void beneath the asphalt, and that's how these sinkholes were born. Crews are just working as quickly as yeah. they can to get this repaired. It's an all hands on deck effort to make those repairs and get these streets back open. Judy just hopes she doesn't have to see another street crew for months to come. It's got to be done right. Yeah. We're tired of living like this. Weather permitting, the crews here hope to have all of this repaired and the streets back open by the end of the week. There is some winter weather in the forecast, though, so if they do not complete it by the end of the week, this work will continue into next week. We're in Brighton. I'm Patrick Perez, Denver 7.